Hey guys, Silence Sale here. Hope you guys are having a wonderful day. Yes, it's been a while since the last Milane Gacha video. I had to give that Gacha video some room to breathe for you guys to go and watch it before I make this one. Even though Basara's Gacha did appear technically the following day. <laughs> but as usual, yeah, you guys need some room to watch the previous video before the new one comes out. Apparently that's how you guys are um, you know, reacting to my videos. So yeah. So, you know, fashionably late as always, let's dive into um, what's brand new with the current event. I'm sure you guys have probably known by now that um, the event episode plates are giving points for a brand new background. So let's do this. Let's change this to background. And of course, you can see this is the brand new one that we are getting. And I have enough points as it is um, from the episode plates that I've already attained to, you know, uh, unlock the background. So let's do this right now. Let's take a look at what the background is. I'm going to fully power up this 5-star episode plate because it's going to be useful for the event later. So why not reuse the resources? Alright, let's see what we get. Okay, so it seems like we're getting a theme park. Um, of course, we get to see the balloons change accordingly uh, during the time period as well as the lighting of the ferris wheel and of course the um, the other theme park attractions as well. They light up, you know. So that's pretty cool. Then of course, we get the balloons that are pretty cute. We get the, fi um, the fire valk and then of course we get the fire bomber characters. <laughs> As balloons as well so that's pretty adorable all right so hopefully you've already unlocked this background for yourself I'm sure uh, because it's not that difficult a thing to attain all right and so let's dive into the gacha page today's video will definitely not be as long as Milane's video because we had a lot to talk about back then all right so let's take a look at Basara's brand new seven star episode plate and how its stats fare uh, total score of 4,295, that's technically one point below Milane's brand new 7 star episode play itself. So if we can predict how it is um, with the current trend, so like last month, Makina and Reina's 7 star episode play actually came with special note attachments on it. But interestingly enough, Reina got the score note attachment instead of what um, Makina had, which was the item note. So just like this month, Milane actually came with the item note attachment just exactly like Makina's and of course Basara if they are following the brand new trend Basara should technically come with a score note attachment as well so yeah so 4295 total score um, at its plus 25 luck value without it it comes in at 4045 so that's pretty decent for a new generation 7 star episode plate um, so gets the highest amount of stats of as usual because they are focusing on you know the character's best um, personality trait I guess because Basara sings more soulful music rather than Milane who is full of energy. Um, then of course voice and charm takes the nose dive down the gutter as usual um, what we see from the recent 7 star episode plates they don't really have a lot of um, balanced stats all around unlike the Frontier, uh, Frontier duo uh, who initially started the trend of special note attachment to 7 star episode plates itself as usual center scale if you use the episode plate on the featured Macross series that the Diva is from well yeah you get the 150% boost in units so or whatever stat they are focusing on so Basara's focuses on so so yeah anyways moving along active skill so just like all the new seven star episodes of plates nowadays they all come with the active skill with combo bonus um, like I said it's it does something but it's not the best active skill out there that you can probably get especially when you want to concern yourself with high score achievement combo bonus is definitely not a skill that it's essential enough to be you know uh, con considered a uh, meta uh, active skill I guess. Alright life skills short skill duration score up 
So, like I said, 7 star episode plates don't exactly have fantastic life skills, but somehow or rather if you want to use this as a life skill support, take note, it has the score up ability, so at a 35 second mark, for 10 seconds, your score is boosted by 20% up. You know, 20% is kind of miserable, but you know, uh, 7 star episode plates do have generally very good stats on the episode plate, so I don't know. Anyways, moving along, there it is! Score note attachment to the episode plate, so it seems like Dana is definitely going with this trend um, from the Maki Reina era where, you know, they start off again with special notes attached to the 7 star episode plates but both divas don't generally give us the same type of note attachment so yeah, it seems like the trend is, you know, the first 7 star featured plate will have item notes then of course followed by a score note um, as usual, these are the two notes are the most important aside from the uh, health recovery note, which is this one here. Um, this is the third most important, then followed by the worst two that's possible to have on an episode plate because they don't really have much use uh, often. <laughs> Alright, so with that said, is Basara's episode plate worthwhile? Definitely, if you don't have Maki Ray's previous episode plate, Milane and Basara's plate are definitely a must get as well because, well, their stats are definitely higher than Maki Reina's um, by one or two points. <laughs> so if you don't have either one, um, both are good generally in its own way. Um, Basara shares the same typing as Makina, which is the Blue Series episode plate. Now of course, Milane shares the same typing as Reina. But of course, both divas have the opposite type of special notes attached to them. And there is a plane flying across my neighborhood right now. I apologize as always, you always get to hear funky noises in my videos. But what to do, this is what happens when you record during a time that, you know, life around the world is still bustling. Alright, so let's dive into the actual gacha itself. We've got our um, subscription tickets that we can use in Basara's. Uh, featured gacha as well as the event gacha tickets like I mentioned in the last video I will use it in this video as well so we'll give Milane a bit more of a chance to uh, redeem herself from the last video although we did get Makina's 7 star episode plate or rather 6 star so that's pretty sweet alright so today we'll start off with the free pool from the afternoon session let's see how it goes hmm Okay, so no Valkyrie animations, not even a load bar, so today's luck seems to be pretty neutral from the well from the way this free pool is being you know summoned. But we do have a low count on quantity on this plate, so we are still getting somewhat of a rare common plate. So that's not too bad. It's still still nice to see Nato Ranka around. <laughs> I do have Super Dimension tickets that are expiring, so let's do a template pool right here. Oh boy, that's 15 tickets that's expiring soon. Hmm. Yeah, so we'll do a template pool. Um, I'll just pull the remaining few expiring tickets on the day that they're expiring. Uh, off screen. Okay, here we go. Templates. Valkyrie animation. Only one? Hmm. Okay, at least the bad luck is going into this rather than the featured 7 star. Oh boy. Red boxes on the first bling. Hmm. I would like the bad luck to be here. Okay. Let's keep going. Red boxes are staying towards the end, so that's not good. <laughs> oh boy. Here we go, first one. No evolution on this one. That's fine. A bit of maki maki love. Alright. Second red box. No evolution on well. Okay. Cheryl gets a bit of love. Oh, Cheryl's played Evolve. Interesting. So, not too bad of a bad flop from this template pool. At least there's some progression. Alright, so at least we're conserving the luck for the featured gachas. So, who knows. Alright, let's see. It would be definitely better to pull out Basara's plate than Milane's because score notes are definitely nicer to have around. 
But you know, Milane is technically my third Macross waifu, uh, so you know, I would like to have a costume. <laughs> okay, let's start with the single free pool from Basara's featured gacha. Okay, no load bar at all. There you go. No Valkyries as well. Hopefully the luck comes on later. Hmm. Alright, let's skip this. Okay, still low digit counts. Things are looking generally misleadingly good. I don't know. Could be bad. Could be good. Alright, let's do the step up gacha. Here we go. Regular rate with a discounted um, 400 stone pool. No load bar. Three Valkyries. Okay. So today's luck is pretty mysteriously decent. Two red boxes on the second bling. Let's skip all the common stuff. Oh, red box. Okay, so we've seen this one evolve in the last video. So that's not too bad. Okay, last red box for the last pool. No evolution. Oh, it's a pretty rare plate, so that's not too bad. Okay, even though it flopped in terms of luck, but we did get pretty rare plates for our red boxes. So that's not too bad, in some sense. Alright, so here we have a higher rate. So it's a 4 star guaranteed, so it's a red box guaranteed, but it could evolve at regular cost of 500 singing stones. Let's see. Load bars? Yes, there is. Okay, so there might be a chance of a new plate, or maybe an evolving plate. One, we have real planes flying, flying in the background right now, so along with the Valkyrie animation. Oh, Rainbow Box! Cool! Alright, so we do have a pretty good luck on this pool. Costume points. Oh, Rainbow Box that lagged a bit. Oh, I thought it was going to evolve. Hmm, was this a good plate for Basara in the olden days? I don't know, I can't remember. Got it. Oh, nice. Okay, so more rare plates coming around. Lots of costume points. That's staying fantastic in terms of episode or collection if you've already unlocked them. Alright, so lots of old plates popping up. I don't know, it's not a good thing technically. Even Basara's... Yeah, this plate is not that fantastic. Yeah, it's old and outdated. Okay, oh well. What to do? At least it's something, but not fantastically great. Ah. Uh. Okay, so let's move on to the next step. So guaranteed rainbow box um, at the regular rate. Hopefully the rainbow box might evolve. Mm -hmm. Oh, load bar. Didn't stay too long though. Here we go. One, two, three, four, five. Yep, yep. There goes our rainbow box. Will it come out in the first bling? Apparently not. There it is. So it seems like that's all we're getting. Only a single red box, a uh, rainbow box. Hmm. Let's keep going. Lots of old plates. Guess that's what happens when you don't give Macross Seven too much love. All right. Oh, was this Milane's birthday plate? Or is oh, no? This was the wedding series. Okay, that's cool. Oh, I don't have it. Nice. Alright, let's take a look at the plate stats. Life recovery, life skill. Okay, that might be useful. Um, maybe when you want to challenge a very difficult difficulty uh, song that you know, might need recovering from just to survive the play. Alright, so the last step. Hmm. As usual, the last step is not the most fantastic. Uh, it does give a higher 
chance of the 6 star plate to appear but you know guaranteed 4 star and above not that fantastic of a rate but still it's something all right here we go Ooh, load bar at least we are seeing load bars for the step up gacha okay that's it really hmm oh boy did we use up all our luck just to pull out Makina's uh, not Makina Mikumo's episode play in the last video oh god Okay, like I said, lots of old plates. Oh, this is gonna evolve. Wow. Rainbow. Ooh. It seems like for Macross 7, I'm getting a lot of Kumo Kumo love. <laughs> wrong diva for the wrong franchise. Uh, okay. Interesting. Alright, a bit of a brotherly love right there. Mm hmm. Oh, I don't even have that plate for Kumo Kumo. Interesting. What is this the cross seven side love for Mikumo? I mean uh, Yoshiki does like Juna in terms of a singer, so huh, that's pretty interesting. Oh well, okay, so let's do this. Are we gonna use the discounted template pool for Basara's gacha first? Or maybe we should use the subscription ticket. Yeah, let's do the subscription ticket first. Then we'll leave Milane the last part of this video. I wonder if my subscription ticket might give me some luck. We, get, we did get a bit of a slow load at the end there. Hmm. Three Valkyries. Five? Is Basara gonna come home? There's a lot of planes flying around now. Oh boy. Three red boxes and one rainbow? Oh, is this gonna evolve? It's gonna evolve! How far will you evolve? Oh, that's it. Oh man, what's with all the old episode plates? I don't need points for Valkyries. I've got all the planes already. <laughs> that's not good. And usually Valkyrie points um, episode plates tend to be very useless. So it's kind of a bummer as well. Oh well. Red box, didn't evolve. And it's a pretty uncommon Basara plate, so that's okay. Very common old Basara plate. Rainbow box, no evolution. Cheryl? What's with all the sexy characters appearing for my Macross 7 pools? We got Cheryl, we got Mikumo. Oh man. <laughs> okay, so. At least it's something, at least there's some blinging in the gacha pools. So I can't complain entirely. Considering how lucky we were in the last video. Alright, so discounted plate pool, let's go. Okay. Oh, no load bars at all. That's not good. Uh oh. Oh no. Disaster. Okay. We do have one single red box, but it doesn't seem to be going to go well. There it is. It's not gonna evolve. Expected. Okay. It's a flop. Oh well, at least it was a discounted pool. Alright, so we're gonna have to surrender for Basara, although I would have liked to have Basara's episode played, but that's kind of a bummer. Let's go for Milane. We're gonna use the event gacha tickets to finalize this pool for Milane. We do technically have some singing stones left on hand, so maybe I might go for Milane's gacha pool. I, I would like to have her costume unlocked, <laughs> at least. Here we go. Three Valkyries? Five? Mm. Will this prove to be good luck for Milane? Okay. Okay, a bit of Nichan love. That's nice. Oh, what's with all the two red boxes appearing first? 
brother and sister appearing together oh no does that mean the rainbow box is gonna be Milane? let it be please let it be here we go let's keep going coming soon oh it is it's got a lomba oh is it Milane? is it Milane? or is it gonna be an older flame it's not Milane! <laughs> <laughs> it's Kaname! Oh, what's with all the Valkyrie love in the Macross 7 series pools? This is just ridiculous. <laughs> it's pretty cool though. I, I do have this episode plate of Kaname fully evolved already, so it is technically uh, one of my few 7 star episode plates that has secret boards unlocked. So that's not too bad. And I do use this episode play of Kaname quite frequently because I don't really have any other Valkyrie ladies with the Blue Series uh, 7 star episode plates yet. So I'm okay with it. I'm actually okay with it. So it could have been nice if it was Milane. Oh well. Maybe, maybe let's just give it another try. Um, you're gonna spend at least another 500 singing stones here if nothing appears from it that that's that's it for me oh boy that was pretty interesting i was expecting this video to flop wow so yeah two six star episode plates in the month of april so that's pretty fantastic considering how unlucky we were in the last month and lots of planes flying by. Seriously, the planes are not actually giving me any luck. Oh, I skipped that. I'm so sorry. But yeah, it didn't turn out anything fantastic, so it's fine. Okay, here we go. The last one. So, oh, I don't have this. Wow. Wait. I do have it? Oh! Well, I don't remember seeing it. Strange. Oh well, anyways, like I said, it's still something. We did get Kaname 6 star episode plate, although I do have its fully evolved 7 star form. But still, having to pull out 6 star episode plates is still something big, even though it's not a new costume. It would have been nice if it was a new costume, you know, because. I don't have to keep counting track on my ever-growing list of 7-star plates that I've yet to attain a single copy of. But still, something fantastic did happen, so that is it guys. Hopefully you guys enjoyed yourself. What do you guys think of Basara and Milane's episode plate? Is this going to be a common trend now for all the future 7-star episode plates? And guys, thank you guys so much as always for watching through the entire video. I did mention it in Milane's video. And apparently some of you guys have actually watched more than the usual amount of all my gacha videos in the last video for Milane. So thank you guys. I know that video was pretty long and there was a lot to talk about. If you guys like videos like that, where we talk about the actual news in Macross um, be it the sales, be it the updates of brand new releases and all that kind of stuff. If you like me to talk about all that, please let me know in the comment section down below. I might do maybe an update video for all things Macross news in the future aside from Uta Macross content. Because um, it seems like you guys really really love all the Macross stuff that's uh, coming out on my channel and even on Instagram. Uh, aside from all the other stuff that I actually love, <laughs> which is kind of depressing in some sense as well. Um, you guys love Macross more than anything else. <laughs> anyway guys, look forward to the next video that's coming out on the channel t later tonight. Uh, I actually put a lot of effort compiling it together. Yes, it is another special sequence video and as usual, those videos tend to not get monetized because of the copyright restrictions for music content so guys as usual share the love share the likes on the you know on the videos and of course subscribe if you have not until then guys i'll see you guys soon bye